we have this question, uh, find uh, integral of this uh, rational function, whereby the, the degree of the numerator is less to, what, to that of a uh, denominator. The power of the numerator is 3. The power of the denominator is what? It's 3. First observation. The second observation is that the denominator is the repeatable linear factor. S plus 1 repeats uh, 3 times. Okay? So what we're going to do in this case is very simple. We're going to write the fraction and that will be equal to when you have repeated linear factor, it's very simple. It's going to be a constant over S, uh, this is power 3. Okay? So it's going to start from power 1. S plus 1. Then the next one we want B over X plus 1 to power 2 and then it will end C over X plus 1 uh, power 3 and that end there okay if it's power 4 it will be what plus d over what s plus 1 to power 4 so on linear factor we start from what power 1 power 2 and stop at what at the at the last at the at the power okay so the next thing to do now is to uh, multiply through by the common factor which is uh, s plus 1 to power 3 the left hand side times the common factor s plus 1 to power 3 that would give us what? And the, just the numerator equal to. Uh, on the right hand side, the fraction here, this one times the common factor. So we're going to have a times x plus one uh, squared. So you have one of this, uh, of this, and you have three of this. So if you cancel to mean two here, plus this, this one also times the common factor. We have two of this. We have three of this. So it's remain one. So b times what? X plus one plus the same thing also. This fraction times what the common factor you have c okay so what we're going to do here now uh substitution will not work in this case because why if i make x to the minus one here this expression will cancel but this will not cancel this will not cancel so that will give me what two unknown so what i'm going to use now i'm going to expand the right hand side expand your right hand side and that will be equal to what uh a if you expand this one x plus one squared you're going to have x squared plus two x uh, plus one plus this one will be what uh, will be uh, bx plus b and then plus c but if you expand this we're going to have ax squared this one times this that's a plus 2a x then this one times this that's a plus a and then plus uh, this plus this and then plus this so what we're going to do now we're going to arrange according to the power of the x so we're going to have this a squared s is here x is there so we can combine it together so i would have uh 2a plus b times what times x and then plus the cos times a plus b uh, plus c so the next thing to do now is to equate coefficients and i'm going to start with the words x squared coefficient of x squared on the left coefficient of x squared will give me what that's two on the on the right hand side coefficient of x squared is what is a so a is two that one is got it. Uh, let's equate uh, coefficient of uh, of x on the left side. Coefficient of x is what is three equal to on the right side. That's a two a uh, plus b here. And coefficient of x is what is this. Okay, and that will equal to three equal to. We have a value for a. That's a two times two plus what plus b. So we're going to have three minus four equal to what equal to b. So b is equal to what? Minus 1. Then let's uh, equate the constant terms. The constant term on the left, that's, that's 3 also, equal to uh, a plus b uh, plus c. So and that will be equal to 3 equal to a is 2. My b is uh, minus 1 and you have the c. So that will be 2 minus 1, that's 1. Move it to that side. So c is equal to what? 3 minus 1 and that's what? That's true. So we've got in all the constants. So this is equal to my a is a, a two over x plus one. My b is minus one, so that will be a minus one over x plus one to power two. Then my c, my c is a two as a two over x plus one to power three. Then you can close the brackets at the x. So this is going to be equal to uh, one over x plus one uh, dx. Uh, this one was minus integral of x plus 1 to the power minus 2, okay, because there's no direct table for this. So we need to do the algebra, algebra uh, as in remove this one over. So we have this. Uh, this is a dx, then plus integral of uh, x plus 1 to the power minus 3. Uh, 
uh, we have an uh, integral of this one, 1 over x plus 1, that's a 2 ln uh, x plus 1. Then this one, integral of this will be uh, minus x uh, plus 1, uh, the power uh, plus 1, that's minus 1, over minus 1. And then the third one, that will be plus 2 into brackets, uh, x plus 1, the power is a minus 3 plus 1, that's a minus 2 over minus 2, then plus 1 plus 2. So this we cancel, this we cancel, and then minus minus, that's a plus. So on the final conclusion, we have this uh, plus uh, this one, we can remove this minus, that's 1 over x plus 1. Then here also, minus a uh, plus, that's minus, and that's 1 over x plus 1, uh, 2 power 2, then plus, uh, plus c. And that's that on this uh, repeater uh, linear, uh, linear fracture. Okay, so you do the, uh, the partial fraction of the repeated uh, linear fracture, then after that, you do your integrations. Okay, so if you're new on the channel or you're a returning viewer, Please uh, click on the button on this video and subscribe. Click on like button and begin to type your comment.